Konnichiwa. I want to eat sushi from your pussy. Oh. Are you racist? Only when I'm driving. Are, Are you racist? Okay. What? African American man, they have something that's bigger than everybody else. Oh my god. I was god. just talking about with my friend, setting her up with my other friend, and I'm like. I swear, man. I love all people. <laughs> Bad man, ting, you know? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bad Man Jackson, back again with. And today, well, first off, we back. You know what I'm saying? Had to take a little hiatus. Hiatus. Don't get too used to him because I, I, I'm gonna try to be more consistent. Bro. I promise. Trust me. Try to trust me. <laughs> but we back again. You know what I'm saying? With you, you know what I'm saying? With another bitch. And today, we gonna be reacting to "Are You Racist?" Keep it one. By cut, not the cut, just cut. It's a, it's a, yeah, I know how cut be coming with a video. It looks like it's a compilation where they ask different people if they're racist or not. I mean, how would you answer if somebody asked you that, bro? Somebody say, Oh, you racist? And you know, that's the first thing they ask you or something like that. What, what would you say? They'd be like, No, or you'd be like, Oh, what do you mean? What, what do you mean by that? Uh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, for me personally, you ask me that question, I don't be like, For the most part, no. You know what I'm saying? Do I stereotype sometimes? Yes. Am I racist? Do I discriminate or prejudice? Prejudice? Is that a word? Exert prejudice. Preji preji prejudice on like another person based off their race or ethnicity or color of their skin? No. At the end of the day, bro, I don't care how you look or where you're from, man. Everybody getting treated the same. You disrespect me, I disrespect you. You respect me, I respect you. I don't talk to you, you don't talk to me. I talk to you, you talk to me. You know what I'm saying? And then we good, we going from there. But yeah, so it should be a pretty interesting video to check out. But before we dive on in it though, please do me this favor. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and hit that bell button so you can be notified whenever I drop a new video like this. You know what I'm saying? Doing so helps me. I'm pretty sure you've heard this link up before in other videos. But you're gonna have to hear from me too, because you know what I'm saying? I'm we trying to we trying to expand. We trying to grow. You know what I'm saying? It, for, the first step is to walk. <laughs> But yeah. So that's all I got. So without further ado. Let's dive on in. Are you racist? Mm, no. Mm -mm. No. Definitely. Well, Hold on. <laughs> Why you answer like that though? That was weird. He's like, mm. Are you racist? Whoa. Yeah. Ooh. Am I what? A racist? Am I racist? That old guy, bro. I should hope not. What kind see. of question? I, I should hope I wasn't not. I was expecting to get asked that. I'm like, no? No. 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 Hell no. That is okay. a multi layered question. Multi well, let's get no? into it. <laughs> okay. He said, I let's get into it. word when I'm by myself and listening to rap songs. I've seen a black oh. man. That came out a lot sooner than I was going to expect it to. But then again, bro, I'm not surprised. Like I said, a lot of them will say the air word. You know what I'm saying? When I'm talking about them, you know, you know what I'm saying? They will say it. You know what I'm saying? Not all of them. Some of them really don't like using the word at all. But you know what I'm saying? A lot of them will, you know, sing along the lyrics and stuff like that. Things of that nature. Sometimes it's harmless. Sometimes it's not. But you can't be in it. You know what I'm saying? You can't say it around people like me. You know what I'm saying? You can't say it around me. I'm gonna be honest with you. Even if you don't mean it in like a, a derogatory or mean manner or anything like that, or like any, you know what I'm saying, demeaning way. Yeah, you know I'm saying it's like a slippery slope thing. You can't like just let it slide, basically. But um, I mean, I won't take offense to it, but I'm gonna just be like, you know, it it ain't smart for you to be using that word, partner. You know what I'm saying? Plenty of other words in the dictionary to use. You can say the same for me, but nah. I'm gonna say I'm, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say it. You know why? Cause it's a, it's a part of my culture, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> but yeah, 
like walking towards me and I cross the street, but I'm always in my head like, please know that this is because you're a man, not because you're black. <laughs> Are you racist? I'm not racist, but I, I'm a server. So, you know, like I know mean? races like, so you stereotype. Oh, without sounding racist. I have definitely you like stereotype, stereotype pretty people much is what you're saying. I'm just like a stereotype. The stereotypes. Like what? The white people smell, they can't cook, they can't dance. Asian hey, not just white people, man. Come on. African American man, they have something that's bigger than everybody else. Oh my god. I was just talking about with my friend, setting her up with my other friend, and I'm like, but you know, he's Asian, so he probably has a small penis. And I was like, fuck, why did I say that? Yeah, you said that. I like you to say it out loud. Up okay, myself bro. To shut up. Are you racist? Only when I'm driving. Are you racist? What? Nah, bro, don't be black. Don't be black and cut her off, bro. Don't cut her off on the intersection, bro. On that, on that, on the highway, interstate. You know what I'm saying, bro? The, mm. You gonna, you gonna hear some R, some hard R's coming your way, bro. You, you gonna, you gonna hear a whole bunch of, you know what I'm saying, a whole bunch of everything coming. Your way. <laughs> it was the only what I was driving, bro. Hey, it's not, it's not, I guess that's one way to put it. You know what I'm saying, some of these police like that too. Jokingly, I tell racist jokes. I like to make a lot of jokes. Sometimes they're race jokes. I do make it's a lot Lago. of racist jokes. When I was younger, I'd like make a lot of jokes about it, but I. She looks like a singer. She looks like a singer. Can't put my name. My, my name. Can't put. Can't put the name to the face. Can't put my. You know what I'm saying? My finger on it. But she looks like a singer. Might not be her, but uh. I realized like what are these like jokes actually saying and like what am I communicating about people through the way I choose to make people laugh. Are you exactly. racist? No. No, not even a little bit. I wouldn't say not that. Even, not even I'm a little racist, bit. Nor I'm capable of it. Didn't anyone okay. tell you black people cannot be racist? Black people can't be racist. And why a lot of people say that though. Racism is an institutionalized thing. I don't think black people have set up institutions powerful enough to like oppress other people. That is very I true. think I can be prejudiced, but I'm not racist. I'm prejudiced. Well, prejudice is a part of racism though. That's the thing. But like you said, you don't have the institution, you know, or the power and authority to really do anything about that. So we can, you know, say and talk as much as we want about somebody else, but at the end of the day, we won't have the power to really affect them in their day to day lives in any kind of way, as well as, as other people might be able to do, to us, especially as black people around the world. Around the world. It's not just it's not just in the US, but it's around the world. It's it's an issue. And uh you hate to see it. But uh, society just has to keep progressing forward and keep, you know what I'm saying, being more equal as well as, you know, giving more equity. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes it's not just about getting the same amount. It's about getting the right amount to where we will be on equal playing field. Because sometimes, look, bro, if you have somebody that's three foot tall, somebody that's seven foot tall, you know what I'm saying? You got to look over a six foot fence. You give both of them a box saying it's equal. Guess what? The three foot tall part still not going to tell about that fence. The seven foot tall part going to see the fence either way. And I got this from a, from a picture, from like a cartoon picture. You know what I'm saying? This is where I got this analogy from. In case y'all wondering, in case y'all seen it, or it sounds familiar to you. But yeah. But anyways, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's a touchy subject. Now people had a huge debate about this, especially like a couple years ago, year ago, about it. And it's just like I feel like it's true that black people i can't say what can't be racist but us saying these type of things won't actually do much to a person i mean it, words words are harmful and they can hurt you but for the most part it's just words for us for for other people for the races like white people for example they words can have some impact in your life bro what they say can literally get you killed sentenced whatever in a matter of seconds bro you know what I'm saying? It's, it's, we've seen it plenty of times. But yeah. I feel like I'm biased when it comes to white people, honestly. Because I don't tend to give them the benefit of the doubt because they come into this world with so much privilege and I need to work on that. Can black people be racist? I'm sure black people can be racist. I think anybody can be racist. Being a light-skinned person growing up in Kenya, there's definitely a up in Kenya? colorism issue going on. Colorism is a big issue in the black community. Looked at differently than lighter-skinned people. If you have like hate towards like a certain group of people, you are racist. I think my dad's a racist. My father was pretty racist. I have some family that are racist. I do have relatives that are definitely racist or Japanese. I also have 
But let's just start racist towards black people. Like, Bang. do you ever challenge them? Or are you like, Bang. Grandma, come on. Nah, I, I let her have it. You let her have it. <laughs> nah, bro, that's the issue, bro. I mean, even if you know, like, you can say that you know better, but if you don't do anything to, to help, you know what I'm saying? Because they passing that down to other people. Just because you ain't going to end up being racist don't mean that your nephew, like, not nephew, maybe, maybe nephew, don't mean that your cousin, you know what I'm saying? Or even your your own sibling won't turn out the way because they exposed to that, bro. You gotta you do gotta challenge that stuff, bro. You gotta correct that way of thinking. If somebody has that 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 you know that mindset towards somebody in other races, then you know that's wrong without them telling you. Because obviously they 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 your elder. So if if you if you know that, then I feel like I mean I I won't say that you're obligated to, but you should point that out and call that out in them. You should say, you know what, nah, you know what I'm saying, that's not cool. Graham Graham, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's not cool, Graham Graham. Them people just like us, you don't have to treat them like that. You don't have to say that stuff about them. You know what I'm saying? I expected more from you. No. 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 Oh, no, never. Wait, children, cannibal. How do you know? Just know that you don't hate people. I feel like you know, right? Like, if you have to tell people that you're not racist, that to me is a great sign. That you're racist. Yeah, you're racist. I mean, that, no. that's, that's. I mean, if true. I am, please someone tell me, because that's so disappointing. Are you racist? I've been told I am. I was like kind of getting upset because I was tired of hearing about if you're white and Christian, you're racist and you get away with everything. And I was like, how can you say that? Yeah, I'm racist because I'm a white person. I think all white people are racist. We have just been put into this system designed to empower our white privilege. As a white person, I am super racist. I know a lot of people like. like in my honest opinion, obviously, obviously, well, white people do have privilege, especially in the U.S. and, you know, say other countries, the major countries, stuff like that. I don't necessarily think that makes you racist. Now, if you choose to ignore that privilege and say that everybody can just do what you do and this, that, and the other, and downplay other races saying, oh, maybe they're just lazy or they don't do this, that, and that, and they don't do work, work thing, things like that, they like to blame it, then you like, okay. You 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 heading that racist way, you know what I'm saying? You on racist avenue right now. I ain't gonna lie to you. You cruising down that junk, you know what I'm saying? But it's just like it's one thing to identify that, especially if you know it yourself and you can admit to that. Then I don't think that makes you racist, cause you're self aware enough to know that your you know what I'm saying your complexion gives you an, an advantage in certain situations, and if you can acknowledge that, you know what I'm saying? obviously dismantling it is a whole nother thing because it's it's based in it bro it's rooted in it it's 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 what was this you know what i'm saying a lot of countries were built on so dismantling it as something else but acknowledging it and spreading that information and not just saying oh just work as hard just do what i did work as hard did. you know what i'm saying just do this just do that you know what i'm saying knowing that it's not gonna work for everybody else like that especially if their complexion is different from yours. Or if they have a different economic background, a socioeconomic background, things like that. that. All that comes into play. You know what I'm saying? So, it's about being self-aware. In the most part. That's, that, that's really what it comes down to. If you're racing, I, it, it's, it's about being self-aware and acknowledging others, knowing that they're different. It's not about not seeing color. It's about knowing that they are different and they have different experiences from you. Embracing that and working towards, you know what I'm saying, coming to a common understanding and really and truly seeing what you can do, you know, both sides to, to you know what I'm saying, understand each other better and move forward from there and, and, and work towards, you know what I'm saying, building something better for everybody, you know what I'm saying, no matter the race, no matter the ethnicity, no matter the color, you know what I'm saying, so. I like to say, yes, I'm a racist because that makes him feel like people okay. know that this I'm admitting my well, faults, well, but like, I'm, I'm, I'm that's a weird like, cop out. out. Have you experienced racism? Oh, heck yeah. Oh, like I grew that? up in the South. I mean, it happens every day, <laughs> really. I've been slammed on cop cars. I've had, you know, guns pulled out on me from police officers. I'm followed through anyway. a grocery store. Got made fun of a lot. Ching chong, ling long, all this and that. Did you like <laughs> jump the border? Can you speak English? Hey, speak English. Konnichiwa. I want to eat sushi from your pussy. Oh, you're the manager? I had more experience yes. than my coworker, and that person was getting paid more than I did. So I was on a football field, and someone had tackled me, and they were like, Asians don't play football. 
I was like, wait a second. You can't say things like that. You sure okay? a little bit, but I was like, little do you know, I got a little black in me. That's why I got two touchdowns already. Yeah, Hold on. Yeah, Are you nah, racist? Bro. Am I racist? You can't get touchdowns without having some black in you, bro. You, you don't have to have black in you to be good at sports. You know what I'm saying? Even though, you know what I'm saying? Studies may show that tends to be. <laughs> That is be the case. Who isn't to some extent? I think everyone's racist. I think everyone, everybody, everybody is racist. The human experience is to have difficulty stepping outside of yourself. I know that I will always make mistakes. I think I'm part of the society that enables racism. We live in a white supremacist culture and society, and we need to actively work every day. So it's a exactly. continual it's, process it's to a, unlearn yeah. things. Yeah, well, it's not something that's gonna happen over time. Just right. gauge in each and every scenario that you go through. Taking like a moment and trying <clears> to see <throat> if you're making this choice based on some unconscious biases. Honestly, deep inside, I used to be racist. I was brought up racist. I grew up at least he in now a phobic knows. culture. There right, was a period like of time where I was like against interracial dating. I remember being very young, having like negative perceptions of African American people, but I've met better people Dang. and opened myself up and I've healed. And I think that just exposing myself and being like, hey, like these people are actually really cool and I shouldn't be afraid of hanging out with them. Yeah. I'm racist. To everybody. You said to everybody. Everybody can get it. I don't like never. nobody. Nobody. So I just <laughs> discriminate equally. <laughs> yes, yeah, nah. If you enjoyed that video, enjoyed any part of it, you know what I'm saying? Please leave a like, comment down below. Are you racist? Be honest with me. Are you racist, man? Just let me. I don't mean get disrespectful down there now. I don't mean, you know what I'm saying? But you know what I'm saying? But we're real with yourself. Hit that bell button, subscribe button, all that good stuff, so you can be notified when I drop a new video, and that you do, so you don't miss it. You know what I'm saying? Whenever I do upload, I will be uploading. Don't worry. <laughs> but yeah, that's all I got. So I love y'all. I'm gonna catch y'all next time. Remember this: bad vibes don't last; they always pass. <laughs> Peace. Don't last, they always pass. Do you know? Do you know?